Hi, my name is Jared, and I want to show you today about creating a towel roll as a gravity stretch prop, as a way to help your lower back and just throughout your body feel better. <laughs> so that's what we're creating, just a rolled up towel. I have attached hair ties, uh, hair elastics, so that it's just easier to move around. We want to start off with a regular towel, like a full-size bath towel. And roll it up into a log. You can vary the thickness based on what's comfortable. And if you don't have hair elastics and you have some string, you could tie that around. But anyways, it doesn't have to be secured in this way. Just use it as is. So you want to take this towel roll and stick it to your lower back as you lay face up. Yeah. Assess how does this feel? Does this feel like a relief? Does it feel uncomfortable? The point of a gravity stretch is to create an articulation in the spine while the body is still relaxed. So we prop up one part of the body and let gravity stretch it back down. You can bend knees, changing the angles, finding more left side, or finding more of the right side, because I'm lifting up my legs and I'm viscerally feeling a different sensation. You can roll a towel up to be midway in your spine. Just lay there and breathe. Um, this stimulates the relaxed nervous system state, um, also referred to as the parasympathetic. And Move your arms in different ways so you can feel different areas of sensation. Check out your upper back. Again, your legs can do whatever. Everything has a purpose. So make the stretch work for you. Create something that's useful. Once you've found the position that you're wanting to settle into for a few breaths, you want to focus on your breath. The pose is the constant, the breath is the variable. Feel your body literally lift and lower with every inhale and exhale. Change the angles of your arms, especially when you're in the upper back. You'll find the weight of your arm creates a different sensation in your back. Right now, I would consider this passive, passive stretching. Because we're just laying here, and we're trying to be heavy. You're feeling the weight of your body, and you're relaxing into gravity. The other approach is to be active. You can interlace your hands, reach away. You're feeling a stretch from your fingertips to the towel. This is called a pin and stretch meaning that you are painting down one spot of your body and stretching to that spot. So wherever you're pinning, that's the aim. And then as you reach from side to side, feel the articulation of your spine and ribs and breathe. 
Breathe deeply so that you can feel yourself stretch from the inside. That's your lungs expanding. You'll find that after a few breaths to a few minutes, your body will have lowered um, at least a little bit towards the ground. That indicates that you did something, that something stretched, something expanded. The reason why this position feels so good for so many people is it's the opposite of sitting at a desk. Right now my shoulders are slumping backwards as opposed to when we are like, ugh, at a desk. <laughs> This feels really nice for the opening that happens in the chest and the back. We are articulating in a new way, balancing out desk work. You can be here for as little or as long as you like. You're in charge. When you feel ready to move on, rotate the towel vertically. Lay back once more, putting the towel right underneath the spine. This is more of a chest opener, while the other position was more of an upper back opener, or back opener. One of my favorite things about the towel roll is that it's wherever you're going to be, usually. Uh, whenever you travel, you're flying, you have to carry heavy bags, and you sit in uncomfortable planes or buses or car seats. Your back feels cramped and rounded. But wherever you get to, usually you can roll up some sort of fabric, like a sweatshirt or a towel, pants. You can lay on top of your backpack. <laughs> you can gravity stretch to arrive. Undo what you are just doing. When you feel like you need more lift, if this is just not enough, and that's a totally subjective experience. It's, it can be anything. But when you feel like you're ready for more, There's a whole world of bolsters, which is essentially what we were just doing, but just a little bit more pronounced. Brings you to some new angles. So again, I start out with the three positions. Low back, mid back, upper back. And I'll go vertically. There you go. Bend the arms. I'll be active and I'll push my hands. Reach. Or just totally surrender, let go. This can be really nice for underneath the neck. <sighs> A lot of times our necks are constantly looking down, be it while we're walking, at the keyboard, on our phones, at a book, on a desk. We look down a lot. And next, they don't love that because when we look down, the spine kind of straightens a little bit. Well, the neck really likes to be curved. So when you lay face up with a rolled up something under your neck, it's doing the job for your neck, for the muscles, so that they can let go. 
They don't need to hold your spine because the towel is doing it for them. Versus a pillow, which usually goes underneath the head. The neck almost always is slightly lifted with the pillow. It's just not being able to relax. It feels comfortable and squishy, but under the neck, oh, that's where it's at. Roll. But let this be a jumping out point for you to explore gravity stretching and all of its intricate parts. The concept of it is, I find, pretty beautiful. It's the physical act of surrender and release because think about this. Point, one of the whole reasons we have muscles is to oppose gravity. Because without muscles, we're just blobs on the floor. Muscles help us resist gravity and stand up and move around. So all the time, our muscles are resisting gravity. Uh, when somebody tells you to relax, that doesn't really mean much. It's, it's too ethereal, too intangible. But if you focus on feeling the weight of your body, feeling your body lift and lower with every breath. If you feel your body settle into the ground and you're, you can feel more of gravity, that means your muscles are relaxing. So it's, to me, it just makes a little bit more sense and easier to obtain. But if you have any questions, please ask me and see you next time. Thank you.